Okay, hey, hey, Jelly Toast here with Dragon Quest XI, Echoes of an Elusive Age, as Definitive Edition. It's gonna be my first Dragon Quest game ever. I didn't watch this movie yet because I just skipped it to get to the title scene. So, let's watch it together. Whoops, and I need to mute my phone. I don't know who any. I don't know who any of the characters are. I don't know what any of this is. I think my game volume is higher than my mic volume right now. So I'm temporarily lowering it right now. Let's see if that's good enough. I have some emotes, I think. Yay! Also, hey Toasty, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Oh, I think I'm gonna like him. Whoa, a showy dude. Ha! Huh. Oh, I'm definitely gonna like her. They're chasing after me on horses. Wow, this looks very beautiful. If this is the quality of all the cutscenes in this game, it's gonna be amazing. Whoa, wait, the old man's actually part of my party too? My first DQ game too. Ooh, hey Nanocha, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Jade's legs, ooh. Okay, let us start this. Bum, bum. Create a new adventure log. Unused. My name is. Jelly. Post. Oh. Ooh, not. Uh, back. A. S T perfect. It fits. That's what she said. I think that's her name. <laughs> uh, and are you happy to perceive the name? Yes. Jelly, I can't say I gotta go Christmas shopping. Just wanna say good luck. Hope you enjoy yourself. Thanks, X. Have fun Christmas shopping. Hydrate. Oh my goodness, why? Oh, before you leave, I hope you get to listen to this. I tried that EX dungeon for a uh, uh for Zillia 2 last night. It's really fun. I'm gonna have to complete it all on my New Game Plus run, though. I don't have high enough affinity. Ugh. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Which mode do you want to begin your adventure in? Don't worry, you can change the way the world looks whenever you like by visiting a church. Well, since this is my very first time playing, I think I should play in 3D mode. Sure you want to play in 3D mode? Yes. Why not begin by adjusting the various system settings to your liking? Which language would you like the character's voices to be in? Japanese! 2D mode route. Yeah, so like, the, um, when I watched another streamer playing it, um, he was actually playing it in 2D mode since he played Dragon Quest XI before. And it looked just like Super Nintendo graphics. It was awesome. Uh, if you use the broken bond thing you get from being game, you get an extra character and without having full affinity. Yeah, but then I found that they don't have, they don't do a lot of damage if they're not linked. So I want to get like four people in there. So I just, I just need to raise affinity. So new game plus, I'll do it. But damn, I wish I could have done it this playthrough, but oh well. Uh, let's see. R will, R up will go up. Yes. Yes, I like that. Horizontal movement. Yes. Automatic. Set if camera will move behind you when 
Auto running. Off, please. Confirm. Average gun on New Game Plus, getting affinity and five times the XP with your grade. Possibly also cats. Ooh. I didn't get any of the cats. So this is what I got on my New Game Plus. I got double experience, five times experience. Um. Uh, double gold. Uh, carry over my enhancers, carry over affinity, carry over the materials from the cats, um, carry over all uh, clothing stuff. So like accessories and costumes and whatnot. And yeah, I think that's what it is. Set display brightness. Choose whatever brightness looks best to you. Uh, that's a little too dark. Yeah, just slightly darker. Happy to proceed? Yes. I know I won't be playing it again. Why won't you be playing it again? Is it too long? Also, tell me if the volume's too high or low. Whoa, he's invisible. <gasps> Oh, he almost got stepped on. Because the very game is very long. <laughs> that just uh, set you to get debt ending. You can always sell all the materials, not use the quest for a couple hundred thousand gold. Yeah. So the only re the only reason why I carried over the cat materials is so that I can like um get money really quickly through um cat quests. I'm gonna have to look for all the cats again just to be able to, like, send my cat out to those areas, but whatever. I don't have to, like, max it out and finish everything like I did before. Sounds good to me? Nice. I do really gotta go have fun look looking at Thanks, X! Thanks for sticking around for as long as you did. Sorry I kept you late, but have fun shopping! And have a good night. It's Dr. Dr. Jettle. Uh oh. Oh no, now she's gonna die. <laughs> Or he's gonna get kidnapped. Japanese dub? Heck yeah! <laughs> Give me them Japanese voices. <laughs> Sounds weird to me since I played in English first. The OG version didn't have duality. Wow! <laughs> Is that Baby Jade? <gasps> Are Jade and the main character siblings? Are we sibs? No, mother! English stuff is really good though. Oh. Well, like, um, I definitely want to see what 2D looks like and what, uh, yeah, so maybe at one point in the game I'll switch to like 2D mode with English voices and then I'll switch back and I'll just switch whenever I feel like it. It's me, Moses. Look at that light uh, from the water reflecting on him. Damn, that's beautiful. The music's so good. It is. Oh, <laughs> 
And the, wow, just everything looks beautiful. The environment, the light, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Several years later. Hey Ultimate, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Hope you've been well. Look at that clothing. Like the threads of the fabric. Wow. Doing good? Nice. Oh, she has a crush on me. Do I talk? Hey Smooth, how you doing? Thanks for joining! You can't, but I can. <laughs> I mean, do people prefer if I play in English or Japanese voices? Uh, I can't see stream right now. Phone almost dead. Will charge and no Wi-Fi at the moment. Oh no! <laughs> Don't die, phone! It's hard for me to take in with the Japanese dub. It feels like a joke to me. Oh really? Then let's, um, let's see. Miscellaneous. Uh, system settings. <gasps> Music! Okay, cool. I hate sound effects. Soundtrack. Symphonic. Cool. Wait, what's synthesized? Voices. Loud. Autoplay. Cutscenes. Off. Protagonist voice. On. Uh, okay. Okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make the music 8, so then I'm gonna raise the volume a little on my thing. And hopefully... That's okay. Um, play however you want to. If you prefer Japanese, stay with it. I kinda do. I like Japanese. Time to quest for a dragon. Heck yeah! Oh my gosh, okay, I'm currently putting the kids to sleep. Don't end it early. I'm not ending it early. Okay. I like this. Claim special rewards? Whoa! Baby boar hat, baby boar costume. Trodane set. You can now choose to drag and quest 8 soundtrack as the music that will play when you are outside of battle. But no, this is my first time. I'm gonna listen to, to Dragon Quest 11 music. Five bottles of pet pop. Okay. You know how the mayor and your mother are waiting to see you off at the top of the steps, don't you? Don't keep them waiting, dear! Oh, and remember, if you're ever in need of some advice or you're stuck up for what to do, have a chat with folks with pretty pink speech bubbles above their heads like me. Just press square and look at the map. You can't miss us. While you're looking at the map, use right stick to change the direction you're facing. It's a handy little trick, trust me. Ruff, ruff, ruff. Both are good. I like English VA dub because each town you visit have different language like French, Spanish. Cool! Oh, that's awesome! Yo, I kind of want to hear that. Let's do that. I want to hear that. And system settings. Audio settings. Oh, like, and I'm double checking it because I messed with my audio settings. Is the music too loud? Or, um, can you hear my voice loud enough? This is my mom and grandma? That's my grandma? Oh, or did she say grandpa before? Just look at you, Jelly Toast. My little boy. Oh, grown up. Now be sure to look after Gemma. Gemma? 
You here? To think, you've been inseparable since you were tiny, and here you are, about to climb the tour together. Oh, and if you ever lose your way, just follow Sandy. That dog's got more sense than any of us. Off you go now, dear. I know the two of you will be just fine, and I'll make sure there's delicious supper waiting for you when you get back. Jolly Toast, seeing you and my dear Gemma all set for your big day makes me proud as anything, both as a mayor and as a grandfather. You're not kids anymore, you know. No, you're grown up now, and that means going to the tour and offering your thanks. Now it's time you're on your way. Head up to the top, give praise to the spirit of the land, then come back down and tell us how you like the view. Oh, and if you're ever unsure what to do next, try pressing triangle and selecting party talk. Gemma might have some useful tips for you. Thanks. Uh, Jelly, I am experiencing this journey with you all the way through. <laughs> just that is moment, kids. I mean, uh, if I had the option, just like that, I, I would have went with Japanese too, but OG didn't have the option. Well, since um, there's different towns have different um, dialects or like accents, I definitely want to hear that and see how they did it. And then maybe if I ever play this game again for like trophy completion, I'll play in Japanese. Uh. Also, my first EQ game, it was such an experience that will forever rival that of Final Fantasy X. I named my character Malik because it sounded like royalty. Mm, I just named mine Jelly Toast because that's me! Oh, every game should have orchestral soundtrack. Oh, beautiful. But yeah, this is my very first Humble very, folk very of cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home. That's how very, it goes, very, very it? first Dragon Quest game ever, so I don't really understand the mechanics and all that, but whatever. My granddad has been teaching me the prayer ever since I was little. Little. He reckons the spirit of the land really does live on cobblestone tour, you see. As long as I can remember, he's been preparing me for this day. The day it would finally be my turn to climb all the way up there and offer my thanks. I just wonder whose idea it was in the first place, sending the village's young folk on such a dangerous errand. What if I take a tumble and do myself a mischief? Do myself a mischief? Well, not to worry. Since you and me were born on the same day, I'm lucky enough to have a bodyguard along for the journey. Whoa, we were born on Come the same on, day. Then. That craggy old thing won't climb its... Oh! What is it, Duggo? Slimes! Ah! Monsters! Monsters! Mechanics are so simple, you don't gotta even be big brain about it. I hardly, I hardly ever died in a game, surprisingly, despite the challenges. Take, take it you're not doing Dragonian Quest mode, which is hard mode. Nope, 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 I am not. Of course I'm not. They're coming this way! By the way, this game, beautiful AF. Yes, it is. Big brain for the secret fight only unless you use Google or YouTube to plan out your moves. I miss this game. Okay, so I will choose what he does. Okay. Get him! <laughs> Go on! You can do Wait, it! Wait, Gemma's not even fighting? Excuse me? Go on! You <laughs> bark at Slime B. Fight! And fight some more. No. Get him. Go on, do, you can do it. Do, 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 do. Go on. Do. Yeah, Gemma's not joining my party. Six experience points, six gold coins, drops a treasure chest, medicinal herb. Crikey. I set the Dragonian quest to never escape that. a battle. <sighs> I know they were Dog fight too, don't remember that. Yeah, I'd currently playing on hard with MC get hadn't been here to help me. Go to title screen similar to Persona 5. No, thank you. The orchestral music is so bizarre, I'm used to the MIDI soundtrack. <gasps> I'm loving this this orchestral score. And now we've gotta go through that horrible dingy cave. Just our She's luck. like, oh how terrible we have to go through this. But I'll she's not even fighting. That's where those awful things came from. 
Well, as long as you're with me, I've got nothing to worry about. Come on, let's get going. Ba -ba -bum, boom. But what is this thing? Humble folk of cobblestone grit. Oh, that's what she um, read before. Ha ha! There's a chest. Open it. I found a pot lid. Uh, equipment. Me. No. Pot lid. Do I have something else? A great sword. Oh, okay, so I could jump with circle. I could dash with R2. Let's read the sign. Read it! Cobblestone Village, Cobblestone Tour, okay. The orchestra is beautiful, but I'm just not used to it. We were robbed of that in standard edition. I will never forgive the Japanese. <laughs> well, that's why they made the super special awesome definitive edition, so you can spend more money on the same exact game for, like, slightly upgraded stuff. Like they did for every single freaking Kingdom Hearts game, huh? But look at that water. Okay, I can't spin the camera for too long or else I'm gonna get dizzy and barf, but let's go! There's something up here, or is there nothing up here? There is a something. <laughs> I found a medicinal herb! These mushrooms don't do jack! Don't make me quote this again. <laughs> you don't want uh, those kinds of views, huh? Preemptive attacks. Get close enough to a monster and a small orange arrow will appear just above them. Press X and you'll give them a weighty wallop with your weapon, lowering their HP before a battle has even begun. Why not try to bring a preemptive attack on the slime over there? Woof woof. <laughs> One HP, oh my gosh. Um, at least the Kingdom Hearts games waited 10 years for a re-release. No, because then they were like, oh, like, oops, I forgot to attack it first. They were like, oh, look, super special edition, super, super, super special edition. Hey, we remade this edition again with, um, for PS3 or whatever. Go on, you can do it. Go on. Uh, besides can play in. 3D mode, 2D, which is brand new experience only if you played DQ11 original. Yeah, um, since this is my very first time playing it, I want to see what it originally came out with, with this beautiful graphics. Uh, at some point in the game, I'm thinking of, um, switching it to 2D view, though. Just to be like, oh, let's see how 2D looks like, but I wanted to start off with 3D. Jelly's favorite cage game, Kingdom Hearts 3. Tough little blighters, aren't they? I'm so proud of you! I learned a spell! Frizz! Kingdom Hearts 3 was so wasted because they basically took all 3D movies that they had and then they just stuck it in the game. If they took 2D movies like Hercules and brought them into Kingdom Hearts 3 with, you know, single, single fireball. Ooh. Yeah, but if they brought 2D worlds into P PS3 graphics for Kingdom Hearts 3, it would have been so beautiful and awesome, but no! Ugh, I have so many problems with Kingdom Hearts 3. You can set the battle system to standard turn-based. Is this not standard turn-based? I don't think I could control Sandy. Uh, well, we got DQ11, but Switch had to wait a year for this version. Oh. They should have given us Treasure Planet. Treasure Planet! Atlantis, um... Oh, I got a slime drop. Okay. Look at these markings on the walls. If I'm playing in 3D mode, I should take advantage of, like, all the 3D-ness the game has to offer. 
like examining my environment. Killing this mouse. <laughs> frozen toast. Ugh, frozen. Needlers. They're cute. Go on. I don't have many feelings towards Kingdom Hearts 3 because I knew they were going to waste it. Fight, fight, and fight some I turned more. my brain off and just went with it. Whoa, why are you using a medicinal herb? Yeah. I didn't even hurt. Oh, I did preemptively. Go um, on, you can do it. Go on. Sandy went that way. That means I'm going this way. Wait, do it again, do it again. Pick up this pot. Pick it up. <laughs> I'm assuming I can't swim. Nope, I can't swim. But this place might come and play later, or, or it might not. This is the very first dungeon. Wolf, wolf, wolf. Hey, a shiny. Copper ore. I thought that was a messed up slice of pizza. Ha-ha! <laughs> Ow, Sandy! Get him! Fight, fight, and fight some more! Go on! You can do it! No, damn it! He completely healed Go himself! On. You can do it! Get him! Good job, Sandy! Tough little blighters, aren't they? Oh my gosh, that was a tough fight! Even though I didn't do anything and com I'm completely useless! Look at all this fog. Poor, blimey. Uh, is this normal, do you think? Yes, because we're going higher into the clouds. Help! Help me! <laughs> that person sounds like they're in very great distress. What? Cole! Help me! Uh, 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 quick! You have to help him! I'm not gonna try to do anything to save the boy, but you have to help him. It's not fog at all. It's more monsters. Ah, real monsters. Watch out! Block with my shield. Would fire be effective against these guys? I mean, they're smog Crikey. and they breathe by. Ow! Don't give up. Dun. Dun. Oh, she healed me. Yo, Gemma, you're awesome. Get him! Go on, you can do it. Gemma. Why is this one so hard to kill? Here you go. Wait, is she using medicinal herbs from the ones I picked? Or is she just taking it from her own well stash? Done. She better be taking it from her own stash. I I'm sorry, Gemma. I only came up here because I thought it'd be funny to jump out and surprise you. Oh my gosh, my acting is so fantastic. But then those monsters appeared. What in the world is going on? I never heard anything about monsters appearing on the tour before. Then why did you say this was a dangerous thing for young people Whatever to do? Were you thinking? If there's no monsters, you you're just killed. walking up a mountain. You take Sandy and get back to the village this instant. Jelly should voice act. <laughs> 
She has her own stuff. Good. Y yes, Gemma. Sorry, Gemma. You better be sorry. You saved my bacon again. I knew you were tough, but crikey. No, I need... I need really Sandy. Gemma doesn't like. Do, 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 do. I no, thought she called you her bacon. <laughs> You're my bacon. Which is... <laughs> Typical. It would have to go and start raining, wouldn't it? Come on, let's get a move on. Let's go up to the top. But first, let's see if there's any shinies. And there are. I found a pink pine. Collect 10 types of items. Cool. Jump! 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 Come on, everybody, jump around! Jump, 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 jump. Yes, 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 I... Fancy a no! Chat, do you? I'm trying to climb the vine. Gemma, I'm not helping you up. You better be able to climb this yourself. Oh, she just magically appeared. Aw, oh, man, can't see anything. How clever of them, just to be like, yo- <gasps> I can fall? What? Okay, that's good to know. I can fall off of cliffs. I would- I just wanted to see the view. This way to the top, watch your step. This is why Sandy can't come with us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because Sandy can't climb vines. Let's see. I don't feel like trying to go down there, so let's just climb. Like obedient little children. Who keeps those torches lit? Wait, if she never heard of monsters on the tour before, then what the heck- Here we are What does she last. think the slimes and the needlers are? They're monsters! What? <sighs> it's such a shame about the weather. I was really looking forward to that view. <sighs> well, we better say the pair and get this ceremony over with, eh? Whoa! What, what was that? Dun dun dun! <laughs> it's a bird! <gasps> oh, she gonna fall! Help! Help me! Help! Help! Let you have two arms. Use it. <laughs> you have feet. Use them. Don't just. Hang like dead weight off the side of the cliff. It's hero time. <laughs> that seems like overkill, but cool. <laughs> We're alive. How? That, that great big flash of lightning. It was almost like you made it happen. What you talking about, Willis? You seeing things. Your hand is glowing! <sighs> Look! The mark on your hand! Mmm, fried chicken tonight. Mmm, chicken. I actually had chicken. With hmm? blue cheese. Oh. Crispy onions and butter well, sauce. Well, we can worry it about that so later. Good. All I know is that you saved me yet again. 
I don't know what I'd do without you. Guess what? You're gonna have to learn, because I'm going on a journey. Now, we really had better be finishing up this ceremony. Humble folk of Cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home, lift your voices up in prayer, sing it across all our drear. Our drear. Blessed are we since days of yore, let it be so forevermore. Ooh, Jesus Rays. <gasps> wow, look! Ooh. <gasps> Rainbow! Oh shit, wow! It just goes on and on and on! Whoever dreamed up this ceremony must have had this in mind. They wanted to show us how huge our world really is. <laughs> well, that's it. It's all over, and now, now we're jump broken. off the edge. They'll all be waiting for us at the bottom. No, jump off. Jump. Get a hang glider. Can I? Can I jump? <laughs> and jump. No, I can't. Damn. Where did the rainbows go? Damn, it's really freaking gorgeous. Deltos and Gemma make their way back to the bottom of the tour. Oh, I don't have to talk to you. You're not important. You're not important. You're not important. Oh, there, there's the pink spot. Well done, you two. Thank goodness you're safe. You did it. We're back safe and sound, Grandad. I want more pumpkin Indeed cheesecake, but are, I already have like dear. three slices today. Should I Thank eat more? Thank the spirits for that. <sighs> when we saw lightning striking up there, we got a little worried, I have to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> Jelly Toast explains what happened to what happened on top of the tour. Well, I never. Sounds like it's nothing short of a miracle that you made it back in one piece. Well, there's no doubt about it. The spirit of the land was watching over you. I am the spirit of the land. Now tell me, my dear, how was the view from the top? Oh, it was wonderful. I saw the sea stretch into the horizon and the sunlight playing on the water and... Oh, I've never seen anything like it in my life. Life. <laughs> You're true Cobblestonians now. Only we have the pleasure of looking out over the world of Erdria in such breathtaking fashion, you know. Are you still young? No, there's got to be a the city in the sky. I'm hoping for a city in the sky. I'm hoping for a city in the sky. Behind. I hope our little ceremony has opened your eyes to a little of what may await you out there. <laughs> now. It's high time we were heading back. I'm sure your mother is eager to hear how things went, young man. Don't keep poor Amber in suspense. Why wasn't she waiting here with you guys? Unless she's making me food. Come on, you. Home time. Hmm. Hold R2 to dash. Just a ticket when you need a bit of a boost. Are the order that the characters are appearing in in the bottom the order that they're going to join my party? So I'm gonna get a little girl next. 
Wow, that's pretty. But living in a totally stone house would suck because it'd be super cold. Coming of age, awarded for ascending to the top of Cobblestone Tour and completing the ceremony that signifies the onset of adulthood. Horse! It's chewing contentedly on a great big mouthful of grass. I thought I would be able to write it, but I guess not. Baba Booey. Hey, Selk, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Ooh. I like how they call themselves cobblestone, but the ground is just grass. <laughs> no cobblestone paths. Sunny! After a single day, I have recouped most of my points. Oh no. Oh no. Don't do it to me, please. Chickens! Look at all these chickens. I want to go into the shed. Ooh. Oh, or there's my mom. Here's my little mom. soldier. Well, not so little anymore. I've heard all about your big adventure. Look at you, all grown up. Guess what, you're adopted. Well, he wasn't too much of a bother, Gemma dear. <laughs> of course not. Quite the opposite, in fact. You would have been proud of him. We got attacked by a monster at the top of the tour, and I ended up hanging onto the edge of the cliff by my fingertips. Uh, I thought I was done It's random for the thing. It's random for the characters in the loading screen. Oh, okay. But you'll never guess what happened next. That mark on his hand suddenly lit up, and a bolt of lightning hit the monster. What did you say? I'm Chrono. That funny little mark. Lightning flying about the place. Goodness me. It's Chrono Trigger time. Here I was hoping he'd turn out nice and ordinary, but it seems his grandfather was right all along. Well, we've been putting this off for long enough now. <laughs> she really is gonna tell when he's adopted. To have a little talk. Here, this belongs to you. Ooh, that's pretty. Your grandfather asked me to give you it once you'd come of age and climbed the tour. The truth is. There's something I've been keeping a Yo, secret is it okay for Gemma to be hearing all this? Never told another soul in the village. It's how can I put this now? Um well, he said you're Oh, I just noticed, but are their mouths lining up with the English dialogue? You're the reincarnation of the luminary. What? What's that mean? <laughs> Oh, don't ask me what the old fool meant, dear. I haven't got the foggiest. <laughs> All I know is that your grandfather said you had a special destiny and that there was something you had uh, to do. Turns out I also get streak bonuses for how many streams I watch in a row. So if I watch 50 streams in a row, I get 5k points. <gasps> I think Jelly should go back to Japanese dub so she can take the game more seriously. What? What do you mean? I'm taking this seriously? He said that when you came of age, you were to head north to the capital up there in Heliodor, and show that necklace thingy to the king. He seemed to think that if you did that, all would become clear. Clear as mud, I shouldn't wonder. Anyway, the long and short of it is that if you want to find out what this is all about, you'll have to leave Cobblestone and head over to Heliodor. Crikey. <laughs> well, I can't stop you leaving, I'm sure, but you won't be marching on an empty stomach. Come on, dinner. <laughs> Gemma, get out of my house. The reincarnation of the luminary. Jelly Toast tries his hardest to sleep, but he's too confused by everything he's learned and excited about his upcoming trip. Eventually. 
I do go to sleep. Mama! Wow, so we just sleep in the same room. Cool. Ooh, where does this ladder go? How high is this house? Hi. Oh, it's nighttime. Or is it morning time? Pots! <laughs> Mother, I'm destroying our house! Luminary Luminaire. Hehehe. <laughs> the day of reckoning for white sauce lovers will come. No! Shadow Flare! Ah, oh, Magus. Sleep in the same room with a harlot. I think not. <laughs> How high is the house? Depends on the strain. What the heck? Check the cabin. I am check. Oh, are there like hidden items? Like these? Okay, so barrels and pots. Break them all. I found a set of plain clothes. It's too quiet. Please play some music again. These pots are not special. These boxes are not special. They're not special. You're ransacking this woman's house after she was kind enough to let you stay. <laughs> She'll forgive me. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I think that was everything. Pew. Wait, equipment. I have clothes. Wait, I already have clothes. Whoa, tro Trodane. Okay. Didn't do anything, but cool. Trodane. Oh, okay, now it updated. I don't have any equipment for accessories. Cool. Mama! Mama! Have trouble sleeping, are we? Well, it's no surprise after all the excitement today and your big news. Whenever I have trouble nodding off, I like to go for a little walk. The night air always does me a power of good. A power of good? Does that make sense? Is that a saying? Equipments change your appearance. <gasps> Future set. Full set will change the appearance. Oh, so it has to be a full set. <laughs> Burglar, thief, vagabond! No! Okay, so I have to go. But I want to see this side of town before I go over. Jump! Ah! Okay, I guess I can't go there yet because there's a dude standing there. A church! A church? Ah, it's closed. Do, 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 do. Okay, so I can walk in shallow rivers. But I can't go into deep water. Do. Why, Gemma? Why? Oh. Bunny Toasty Jade. Peter, French eh? toast, wheat toast, jelly toast. Oh man, Cyberpunk 2077 looks weird. Hey Pancakes, how you doing? Thanks for joining! Yeah, it looks totally weird, right? You remember this tree, don't Bikini you? Bikini Jade is- Oh! <gasps> Bikinis! Swimsuits? Oh my gosh! Swimsuits! I got my scarf stuck in it all those years ago. Hello! There hope I was, you've been well, dude! Crying like mad, and there you were, running around trying to help me get it down. How many times is she gonna lose her scarf? <laughs> Some things never change, eh? You're gonna have to learn how to get it on your own now. Cause I'm leaving. You know, I always imagined we'd spend our whole lives right here in Cobblestone. I wanna play Cyberpunk so bad and I have it just wanna upgrade my graphics card first. I don't think I'd be so able to play it because it's a first person. Said today. Sadness. All that stuff whoa, whoa, I dropped my controller. <laughs> oh no! I missed her line of dialogue! She just said, I heard your mom say. I remember the story my granddad told me. 
Once upon a time, long, long ago, the world was terrorized by a horrible monster. But then the lunar version has so many outfits though. The day. Nice. I'm gonna get all the outfits. When it was all over, the <gasps> That's another thing. Star. Okay. So before and I started New Game Plus on uh, Zillia 2, I saw that there was one more outfit for Gaius I can get. And it's his Zillia 1 boss outfit. Where he's like kind of topless and you can just see his abs. And I was like, why did I pick this up earlier? I was so mad. But that's the costume I'm going to play with my, my New Game Plus account. That's his I heard your mom say she loves right my... What? Why? Uh, she hears you breaking things downstairs and thinks he's How taking the news. How can you be the luminary too? <laughs> I, I just don't get it. What do you know, Gemma? I know. That's what you're going to Heliodor to find out. I understand. Really, I do. Listen, we should both be getting back. Everyone will be wondering where we've got to. No, everyone else is sleeping. Weirdo. Goodbye, old friend. It's still nighttime. I can still see you tomorrow. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Exhausted after his long day, Jelly Toast finally falls into a restless slumber. Then morning comes. Mother! But not really my mother. <laughs> Here's this extra outfit that shouldn't belong in this game. Well, just look at you. you Anime girls need to learn how time you know. works. Only wish your grandfather were here to see you. You must have been so tired from ignoring that girl's feelings. Ha 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 ha! You won't forget him. Man, will you? ignoring a girl's feelings is so fine, draining. Outstanding man, the pride of the village. You could do worse than try to be like him. You could do worse than try to be. I don't get that. What? Well, however you turn out, I'm sure you'll find a way to overcome whatever lies ahead. A mother knows these things. Oh, by the way, I've popped a little money I'd saved for money! a rainy day in your pack. Don't spend it all at once. Why don't you visit the village shop before you head off to Heliodor? You'll need some supplies for your big adventure. But don't take too long. The whole village is turning out to wave you off. Oh, dang, how did the whole village here? <laughs> She's like, hey, guys, I never told a soul in this village, but... You're the reincarnation of the luminary. Now the whole entire village is gonna see you off. Bye! <gasps> Shiny! Shiny on the house! Jump! No! Shiny on the house! <laughs> A pink pine! Hooray! <gasps> Shiny on my house! A treasure chest on my house! Oh my gosh! Hey, old man, I don't have time to talk to you. I need to jump on my house. Uh, how do I jump on my house? Can I break these? Yes! Break the barrel! Get 10 cold coins. Unless I climb all the way up to. No, I could jump up here. Gimme? Gimme? What? I have to be right in front of it? That's annoying. 50 gold coins. Flurry feather! Okay, any more shinies? Or chest? Okay, shiny on top of that house. Cool, let's go. Yeah! Damn it, missed. No chest for you. All the chests for me! You guys don't see me yet. Sandy! Sandy, who do you belong to? Do you belong to Gemma? Du -du -du -du. Medicinal herb. Okay. Ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba. Oh, 
Okay. Now I shall go to item store, which is this way. Doo -doo. Said all chest for me once. That's how I got slapped out of feminism. <laughs> oh my gosh. Doo -doo. Jump! Jump! I need to talk to an old dude first, I guess. I heard all about it from your mother. She said there's an important journey you have to make, and you're just a youngster. Well, before you head off, make sure you visit the shop. You know where it is, of course, down the slope and across the river. Once you've stopped up, head up to the village entrance to the north. We'll all be waiting to see you off. I... Yes, thank you. What's purple? West? Deary, deary me. What am I going to do? Oh, if it isn't young Jelly Toes, you came along just the right time. I've got a favor to ask, Steve. The other day I was playing with my lad, you know, messing around as you do. Well, anyway, he's got this flurry feather that he loves and, well, fool that I am, I managed to let it blow away. Luckily, the wind only blew it as far as the roof of your shed. I'd go and get it myself, but I'm not too good with heights, I'm afraid. Anyway, I know you're a brave young fellow, so I was wondering if you don't mind clambering up there and getting it back for me. You'd be doing me a huge favor, I'm telling you. I already got it! I knew you'd help me out. You always paid attention to what the priest said in church. You know, that stuff about always being kind to others. You're a fine fellow, no mistake. And there's no time to lose. My son's desperate to get his beloved feather back. Hurry on over to your shed. I'm sure you've climbed onto your fair share of roofs, but just find something to climb onto and press circle to jump on from there. Once you've had that flower feather, bring it back here and I'll see if I can't get you a little something in return. Best of luck. I already did it. Take my feather. There you are, Jell Toos, and it looks like you got the feather. Would you mind me uh, have it? I hand over the photo. Thanks, I knew you wouldn't let me down. I can't wait to see the look on my boy's face. Oh, and before I get it, here's a little something in return. I got a sleeping hibiscus. And that's not all. I got a tip for you. I hope you'll find it useful. If you ever want to do someone a good turn, look for a purple speech bubble above their head. Listen to what they have to say and see if you can do anything to help. It always pays to be kind to others. But don't feel that just because someone shared their woes with you, you have to help the right way. You can always come back when you want a little change of pace or if you're not sure what to do next. Anyway, thanks again, Jellatoes. I really owe you one. Now just remember, whatever's waiting for you, uh, be kind to others and you'll do just fine. Finast! Whee! Oh, wait, they have English accents. What am I doing? I gave him a southerner accent. Whoopsies. Wait, I have to talk to you again? I heard all about it all from your mother. She said, oh no, I already talked to you. Why am I talking to you again? Call Blimey. Hello, governor. Where is the shop? Are you the shop? Hello. So you're leaving good old cobblestone, are you? Well, make sure you've got all the essentials before you set off. Welcome, valued customer. How can I serve you? What would you like to buy? That's an interesting <laughs> country accent. Backbreaker turned off, so lost power to the room. Oh, what? What? Crazy. Sounded like a character in the Phoenix Wright anime. Ha 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 ha. Let's see. Mm, let's see. Wayfarer's clothes. Ooh, 70G. Medicinal antidotal herb. Uh, yes, please. I'll get five just in case. And, um. Uh, I will get a Wayfarer's clothes. Me. No. Uh, no, 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 that's it! Oh, because I don't have the full set on now, I would, uh... But the Wayfarer's clothes are stronger, I'm sorry. Uh... Magical offensive. Yeah, sure. Um, items? Okay, I'm gonna. No. Hey! Uh, transfer to the item bag. Yeah. Nah! Oh, it's because I bought five of them. What's the point of holding on to this, though? Should I just have potion medicinal herbs? Okay, you know what? I'll just keep one on me, just in case. Okay. I think I'm just about done here, so let's go to the north. 
Must be tired because she's acting weird. I am tired. How'd you know? Can't go to outfits to select any outfits you unlocked. Outfits! Outfits. The Trodane! Ooh! That way you can have equipment. Oh, thanks for telling me. Mama! So, this is it. My little soldier's really leaving. I forgot what her voice sounded like already. Might not be back for a while. Hope you said all your goodbyes. So, ready? Well, off you go then. One day you're just a little boy. The next you're getting ready to leave us. I only wish your grandfather could see what a fine young man you've become. <laughs> to think, it's been so many years already since old Chalky found you floating in the... <laughs> 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 well, <laughs> well, <laughs> since he brought you to Cobblestone. We never thought there was anything out of the ordinary about you. And now suddenly there's, there's all nothing this out of the ordinary of about you, except for the fact that you were found face. in a river. <laughs> like you all know babies who are. the luminary was, of course. A legendary hero who saved the world from a terrible darkness. And we're supposed to believe that you're him reincarnated? <laughs> I don't doubt old Chalky, of course, but it is a little hard to swallow, I must say. Oh. When you meet the king of Heliodor, put in a good what word for What if the king tries to kill me and he's like, yo, I don't believe you. If he finds out this is the village where the luminary was raised, there might be something in it for us. <laughs> if you catch my drift. Oh, you are terrible. Trust you to be thinking about what you can get out of it. Out of it. Oh, no, I'm only joking, of course. <laughs> Very <laughs> Totally <thought>. <laughs> joking. <laughs> wink, <laughs> wink, nudge, anyway, nudge. Anyway, where was I? Ah, yes. Now, the fate that awaits you may well be one beyond anything we simple country folk can imagine. But you must allow us to offer what little assistance we can. Take this map of Erdria yes, with you. Yes, thank you. I need maps. Might prove useful in finding your way. I got a map. He's setting up his connections, that's all. Wise man. Uh, uh, hit, hit. Oop, oop. And may this magnificent steed the facts. pride of cobblestone Lighten your burden and speed you on your way. Show us the meaning of haste. You'll find Heliodor easily enough. Just head north out of the village and follow your nose. You travel safely now. Oh, you're such a good boy. Such a good boy. You make us proud out there, won't you? And come back safe. I shall, Mama. There's a lot of people in this village. Wait! No! You're too late! <sighs> Here, take this with you. I... I made it for you. Thanks, it's garbage! No, I'm just kidding. I got Gemma's charm. It will keep you safe. I heard there are lots of monsters where you're going. Be sure to keep it close, won't you? Oh, I don't know what's in store for you out there. But wherever you go and whoever you meet, don't... Don't forget us, will you? Take care. And remember, we'll be waiting for you. Sell it? <laughs> For real? Sparkly spots on the ground? Yeah, sure. Sell it, Nod. Whoa! Need a horse? Nay, bother. Huh? 
Horses are an incredibly convenient way to cover large amounts of ground in very little time, but you'll sometimes have to enter areas that can only be explored on foot. Don't despair, though. A ring on one of many summoning bells dotted around Erdrea will soon bring your faithful friend galloping back to your side. Horse! Jump, horse! Or don't. To the mangle grove. Oh, wait, you don't want to be going anywhere near the mangle grove. The monsters in there will have your guts for garters. No, if you're headed for Heliodor, you need to go straight there. Horse! Where's this? Heliodor region party place. I won't go through here if I were you. The monsters up that way will make mincemeat of you. It's Heliodor you're trying to get to. You need to head north anyway. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that's a bird. No. Should I fight all these dudes? No, I'll level up some other time. Horse! I'm pretty sure I'm missing a ton of like treasures and items and stuff and whatever, but whatever! Horse! Woohoo! Hold on a second! Well, I went back to Southern. Oh, what have we here? I know a budding adventurer when I see one. That's all she gets. That's not right. It needs to be behind a paywall. Run over them. Wait, I could run over the monsters? It can be risky heading into the great outdoors if you aren't familiar with the basics of survival, you know. If I run over well, the monsters, is it like automatic not, I kill them and that's I get where I come in. See the remains of that fire over there? Well, when you spy one of those, it means you can set up camp and rest your weary bones. To settle down for the night, just go up to the fire and examine it. You'll soon be enjoying a well-earned break. So I'm gonna need like tents and campfire You're stuff. What's that? You're worried about being attacked by monsters while you sleep? Oh, ye of little faith! Monsters don't like tents. That statue over there is chock full of holy powers that'll keep the beasties at bay for as long as you need. And that's not all. You can pray Ooh. to it to be cured okay, of poison so statues and are all mini kinds churches. of other things. Think of it as a mini church. Anyway, enough of my yammering. Why don't you take a closer look at all this camping kit for yourself? You'll need to get used to what campsites look like and how to find them. After all, you'll be relying on and them there's whenever a horse you're out bell, in the wilderness. So I can call my horse back. It's like my old dad always said. Keen campers can continue on where others can't. Be prepared. P -p -p. Well, that's all from me. If you have any camping-related queries, feel free to ask. I'm here all the time. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Ew. I would. I don't like camping. Haha. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try running over monsters. Horse! Run over! Oh! <gasps> Excellent. Die! Come on! Come on, where are you at? Gah! Come here. <laughs> oh, he ran away. Boo! Haha! -ha! Go back and kill all the slimes. <laughs> kill the bird! Horses can really run over birds. Ah. Boom! Boom! No! Come back! I need to kill you! No! Damn it! I'm too weak! I'm going to die! Without Gemma using medicinal herbs on me, I will fail! 
Never mind, they died. Okay, line up with the bird and boom! Pa! Ah, ah, gosh darn! Yeah, got him. Needlers! Come on, come on! Oh, he ran away. Bird. Bird! Oh, damn it! Oh, I ran into a wall. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm good. You can kill monsters if you run into them, or at least the small ones, but sadly, no experience? Then what was the point of this? I was doing it just in case it, like, you know, gave me experience. Does it at least give me money? Bunny corn. <laughs> Get wrecked. Hmm. -da -ba -da -ba Maybe I should level myself up to level five before I move on. To be safe. Okay, so I got fully healed because I got leveled up. Otherwise... Yo! This is awesome! You can change the camera view in battle and it'll stay like that? Yo, that's awesome! Yo! Listen up! This is a story about a blue guy who lived in a blue world. And all day and all night and everything was blue for him. You know you can run around during a battle, but it's still turn-based. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! So I could just be like, all up in my face. Wow, the needler does a little dance. Whoa, the bunny corn dodged. Damn it. Who said you could dodge? How dare you? Finally out in the open world? Uh, if this is considered open world, then yes, I am! How many more experience do I need? I need... Uh, 55? Oh, gosh! Kill! <laughs> I want to try finding frogs. Bye, bird. Oh, I can't. Awarded for sending 20 or more monsters flying already to mount. Wait, but if I dismount, then I lose my horse, huh? I don't want to lose my horse. I don't want to go looking for another bell. So let's just keep going. Pow! <laughs> oh, wait, uh, I have to go this way. Oh, I can't run over. Okay. Pyong! 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 Okay, now I'll really try to, like, fight them. A hammer hood appears! Jelly's a bully. I'm not a bully! What you talking about? Ha! Critical hit! Seven experience! I should heal. A sweet, simple Galuka which Gemma poured her heart and soul. Muse? He can feel the love that Gemma poured into making it and is filled with renewed courage. Huh? 
Uh, sort by type, yes. A baby board. This was not in one of my what? Excuse me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Frog. Sell it. <laughs> you can't though. I can't sell it. Boo. Danish meat ring. That sounds amazing. What is a Danish meat ring? Ow. These guys hurt. Ow, you're near me and I'm gonna run away. <laughs> Come get me. Come and get me. Come and get me. Dun, dun, dun. Sixteen experience points. Wow. Uh, I need nineteen more, so let's heal up. Maybe I should have bought more medicinal herbs since I'm hurt. Let's see, what's an enemy I haven't fought yet? I'm guessing enemy encyclopedia is gonna be an eventual trophy or something. Oh my, what the freak? <laughs> it was a bird. <gasps> oh, that scared me. Hi. Uh, bore outfit for someone else. It's like Cold War survivors. Beef Wellington? Mmm, Beef Wellington. Mm. Another RPG? Yes, Dragon Quest. I was like, hey, Regal, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Wait, I meant Swedish meat ring. Swedish, Danish, European. It's amazing. I don't know if a Danish meat ring is a thing. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of a light bulb, it's a fright bulb. I found a cotton top. This music is gonna get old. It will never get old. What? The power of pep. If a character is attacked a lot or undergoes certain other trials and tribulations, they'll eventually enter an innervated state known as being pepped up, which will boost their martial might for a while. But nothing lasts forever. After several turns have passed, they'll lose their glow and go back to being their normal selves. However, any characters who are pepped up when a battle ends will still be so when the next one begins. So it's like limit breaking. I need to fight one more, I think, to level up. <laughs> Trumpets, bruh! Heck yeah! I learned heal! Three skill points! Every time a member levels up, they will earn some skill points. As the name suggests, they can be used to acquire new spells and abilities. To use them, open up the character builder from the mis menu. Use skill points right away. Yes! The character builder is where you can use skill points to teach your party members new spells and abilities and also improve their attributes when you unlock a particular panel. The ones around you will become available, expanding your options even further. Think carefully about what to unlock when, when you work your way to the ultimate abilities. Ba -ba -ba Luminary? Skills and stat boosts available only to Yggdrasil's chosen improvements to a wide range of attributes are available. Include sword mastery overall, attack power. Great swords, weighty two-handed swords, increased offensive would also say the pathway to the sword mastery. Pave the path. Uh, let's see what Luminary has. Pep chance, 5%. Um, sword mastery. Oh, I have to serve. Okay, so I can't even do that yet. Flame slash! Yeah! Cool. Now I have zero points. Uh Oh wait what? Uh Danish meat ring is not a food thing, it's an unpleasant thing. Oof. We should have played DQ Builders. Yeah, I like this though. Respect the classics, man. Pep is like tech chrono trigger. Mm. My chair just broke. Oh no! 
What the heck? Oh no, that sucks! Broken chairs suck. Can I save on the map? Or do I have to save at a certain place? Okay, so it looks like I need to save at an actual place. So probably either at a statue or at a church. Well, the damn. Here we go! last time. Oh, a new enemy has appeared. It's a duck snake. We're an hour into the game and you already have Epona? Heck yeah, a platinum punk. I'm pepped up. Don't mess with me. Ow, he's pretty strong. Just kidding, I killed him. He's dead. How much gold do I have? Two or three. Pow! Oh, he ran away. Oh, uh, where am I? Head for Heliodor. That's to the Emerald Coast. Oh, so I just go up here. No, I should try to find another dude while I'm still pepped. So you! Save at any camp or church, it automatically saves when you load into a new zone. Oh, really? Cool. There's no point in grinding these enemies because there are specific enemies that give you a ton of experience. Okay, oh, but there's a shiny! Must get the shinies. I found a cotton top. I have medicinal herb. Cotton top. Hooray! Things. D -d 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 jump. Oh, horse can't jump. Just want to take a look at the environment before I go in. Okay. Keep it now for exclamation marks. Like these guys give like 10 or 20 EXP. There are enemies out there that give you 2,000 experience per kill. Yeah, but I just started the game, so I think I'm I'm not gonna run into them now. Oh, pretty. Whoa, it's a creepy statue. I can't jump. I haven't seen you round here before. Hmm? You're here to see the king, you say? Well, you won't find him round here. You better head to the castle. Go straight up this road, climb the steps, keep going, and Bob's your uncle. Just remember that they shut the gates as soon as the sun goes down. The king needs to sleep, you know. You better start heading this bright and early if you want an audience. But that's not the half of it. He. West! West! Ah, Amelia is stuck on the roof! She won't come down! Ah, somebody help me! Amelia is stuck on the roof! You have to help! Oh, uh, sure. Oh, thank you! Thank you so much! You're so nice! Please get Amelia down! She's scared of heights, you know! Amelia, doko! Wow, Amelia, stuck on the roof! I'm gonna have to find where this roof is. Gosh darn. Amelia! Amelia? Uh, can I take more than one quest at a time? Came all the way to Heliodor with just one goal in mind to catch a glimpse of two of two of the greatest heroes in all of history, Sir Jasper and Sir Hendrik. 
The only problem is they won't let me into castle. Can you believe it? Well, if I'm not going to get to meet the person, I suppose I'll have to buy my time by reading up on them instead. You know, if you want to earn my eternal gratitude, you can help me find a book about the exploits of these two fabulous knights. Uh, Oh, thank you so much. I know there's a book about my two favorite knights just sitting on a bookshelf somewhere. I've taken a look around the west of the city, so maybe you should head east. If you see any bookshelves with red books in them, take a closer look. Apparently, they're the ones worth reading. If you do manage to find a book about Jasper and Hendrik, make sure to come back and tell me about it, won't you? Good luck. Uh, yeah, ignore all these normal monsters and stay low level until like. <laughs> Never played the game, so I'm not sure. Wow, thanks. Apparently, you can find them now in Akuma. I just Google, not gonna tell you what they are, but you can find them in NCO Orient Champs of Champs Sauvage. I have no idea what this stuff is. But there you go. The towns of this game are to die for. I never want to leave them. Yes, take as many quests as available to do. You'll need a certain pet and characters to get the benefit of that EXP enemy. I'm sure I will. I don't think I could take them on my own. Say Jasper every time. Henrik's the best. Where is Amelia? I'm assuming Amelia is near that kid. That's it. I need to find Amelia. Ah, church. Church? Good day, sir. How may our church assist you, faithful disciple? Confess to me all that you have done, child, and I might record it in an adventure log. Yes. Divination, resurrection, purification, benediction, play in 2D mode. I have successfully recorded your adventure log. Do you tend to continue to just... Is there any way we can be of assistance? Maybe if I play in 2D mode, I'll be able to find the cat better. Let us pray. Where do you want to begin your- oh. Oh no. No, 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 I, I give up. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. <laughs> I'm CJ and two other characters are party and they all have to have certain pep easy experience. Ooh. Cancel. I thought it would just automatically turn where I am right now into 2D mode so that I can find the cat. But nope, that was not meant to be. Can I climb up that thing and then maybe see where the cat is? Would the cat be a different color? They really put a lot of work into, um into these textures and whatnot. Ugh. Kid, where's your cat? <laughs> Just tell me which building it's at. Maybe it's stuck on a roof. But which roof? Screw you, kid. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna move on first. Oh, wait! Okay, since I'm up here... Um, Royal Square. Let's try going into this house and see if there's books. Wait, what? The small on the door jelly toast takes a closer route. One is currently indisposed, shan't be long. Okay. Okay, that's blocked off. Hi, I'm breaking into your house. I'm just seeing if there's a red book in here. Okay, can't go in. Uh, red book. There's a book called The Lurid Allure of the Dingy Dungeons. Jelly Toast takes it on a shelf as a close look. Far below the basements and storms of Heliodor Castle, deep within its very bowels, lie the dungeons that house the most heinous and hardened criminals in the kingdom. Many who have been locked away in these cold, dank cells have not lived to see the outside world again. Those whose crimes have are deemed truly unforgivable are thrown into the deepest cells of all, which it is said to be all but impossible to escape, a death sentence in all but name. Take care to stay on the right side of the law, dear reader, lest you too be locked up at the key thrown away forever. 
But wait, don't we get a party member from a dungeon? I bet we're gonna get thrown in jail. Falsely accused of a crime, like stealing a girl's lunchbox. Ah, treasure chest. Hundred gold coins! Damn, I'm rich! Okay, so I think it is worth going back to like sneak in everyone's house before I move on. That way I could find the, um... Hi, pretty lady. You see that big swanky house over there? Well, it belongs to some rich and slightly vulgar stranger. He just turned up one day, bought the land and had it built. The showy blighter? Whoa. Ha! I can't get in. Oh, psh, psh. I was like, I can't get in! There's a gate. Yo, can I Assassin's Creed this? Ready? Ready? I'm at CO! Oh, I can't jump. Come on! I'm Ezio Auditore. Come on. I'm Desmond. Desmond Miles. Yes! Three gold coins. I'm rich. Uh, are we asking for a cat hint? Yes, please. <laughs> I maxed that MC attack hit point to 999 and the game got so boring. Nice. Gotta lurk and go play Genshin a bit. My resin is probably capped at 169 and it's not good. Oof. I told you because you like to grind off screen so I didn't want you to waste your time at those barrel... Yeah, I do like to grind off screen because I don't think people would enjoy watching me level grinds. Come on, let me just jump onto this roof so I can find the cat. I don't see the cat. Let me tightrope across. <gasps> I can! I was just joking, but cool. Okay, cat, where are you? Oh, there's Amelia! I found it! Amelia! Ready, ready? Jump! No! Cat nearby armor shop building. Yeah, I saw it up there. There's probably a different way to be able to like jump up here. Yeah. Oh, damn it. Jump on the barrel. Jump on the what? Wait, but even if I jump up there, I don't know like how to. Cat. Yeah! Like, I can't jump up here. And I don't know how to, like, hang. So how do I get cat? <laughs> and I can't, like, hang on the... Man! This, oh, this really feels like, you know, Assassin's Creed type of stuff where I could just climb up onto anything, but I can't. There's a book called The Spider's Guide to Monsters. Jelly Toes takes it from the shelf and has a closer look. Intrepid adventurer, this book should press upon you one thing before you set on your quest to see the world lightly, but there's a monster that will land at night or far more fiercer than the rules of the day. day. Heed these words while adventure and go abroad in the evening, only if you are prepared to meet the jinglish that await you. Okay. Hi. Flax and thread. But no books. You suck. Okay. But then how do I get up? That's the problem. Have the right idea of going inside buildings. But which building? I can sleep here? Cool, I guess. Um... Maybe I have to go into the item shop? Oh wait, what? I can't- I can't jump on these ropes though, no. <laughs> item shop? 
Medicinal herb! <gasps> a ladder! Amelia! Six gold coins. So rich. Amelia! The cat's paw seems to be stuck in a hole in the roof. Do you want to help it? Yes. Gently removes the cat's paw from the hole. Meow! You helped the little girl's cat. Go and tell her the good news. Cool. Um, but I have to find a red book in a house in here. So I went inside the church, but I went inside there, went inside there. Okay, so I'm guessing it's one gonna be one of those last two houses, okay. Got your cat! You you did it! You got Amelia off the roof! Thank you! Oh, thank you, thank you! Here, take this! Got a bag of kitty litter! If you got up on that roof, you can get onto others. You can probably even climb down chimneys. Nice glasses. Kitty litter! Gross! Okay. Um let's do item shop. A chimera wing? I'll just get five more medicinal herbs. Just to make it even ten. The bag it is. Whisks the user away to the last place they prayed or the last important location they visited, consumed upon use. Yo! I'll get three! Uh, the item bag will carry it. That's it. Thank you. Um, okay. Now I'm going to go into the last two houses, see if I find a book. And then after that... So he, then he says to me... <laughs> to see if I can find a red book to complete the other quest and then I can move on with main story! I got fish that stockings from this granny's closet! Oh, she lives with someone else. <laughs> Sorry I ransacked your house. <laughs> Jump! Halt! Sorry, but this area is off limits. Now, if you wouldn't mind clearing off. I'm sorry. I bet I'm gonna have to come out of there later. Red book? Red book? Red book! This book called The Soldier and the Strategist's Tale Two Heroes Jolly Toast Saves and Resolve and has a closer no matter how ferocious an assault the monsters may launch against Heliodor, the greatest kingdom not shall not fall for two heroic figures will stand in the path of any attack. And the first is Sir Hendrick, a warrior without equal countless times as he ridden on his colossal black scene, as he furiously into the heart of an oncoming assault, standing the enemy like so many leaves. His chivalrous to a fall and considered by many to be the greatest swordsman in the world, even the violence most tiring troll did not stand its ground when his face was a growing great sword. That's the guy this gamble do is short and ingenious Sir Jasper, regarded as the sharpest military mind of the age, he has let out heavily outnumbered forces to force victory again and again. Those are swordsmen he may be no match for Sir his ability to analyze any battlefield and quickly arrive at the ideal strategy for the situation at hand is unrivaled. But these two great men, the swordsmen and the strategist, to protect the Heliodor needs the fear no fear. Blah, fear no foe. And the book of the Sure, I'll just tell him about it, but I won't bring him the book. Nice. Break pot. Chunk of Flintstone. What are all of these things for? Is it like, is there crafting in this game? Also, I hope that you guys don't mind that I'm just like trying to read all the extra dialogue super fast, but it's just like, I don't want to not read it because it's showing up on the screen, but at the same time, I don't think it's that interesting to listen to all of that. Oh, another red book. What are you? There's a magazine entitled Down and Out in Downtown Heliodor. Association for the Shelton has a closer look at the last month as you read shed some light on the lesser known highlights of Heliodor's historic city center. This month, we'd like to take a moment to talk about the city's diverse downtown district. The land this quarter occupies one third that is the first church, but the town's population growing by the day. New arrivals had no choice but to make their homes in this ditch beyond the walls. Soon, the bustling shanty town had attracted a whole host of colorful characters that came to be known as a place of great risk but also great opportunity. Downtown Heliodor's struggle with crime is no secret, but for some thrills like kids, it offers an excitement no found nowhere else. Do you dare take a walk on the wild side? Yes, crafting? Uh, okay. Oh, I broke a bucket. Whoops, sorry. Let's get out of here!
Hein <gasps> no! The king is sleeping! I wasted too much time! No! No! Can I sit? Nope. Oh, dip dam. If I go to sleep, will it change time? Oh, maybe I'll visit the weapon shop and armor shop. Oh, hello there. I can tell from that look in your eyes that you found that book. Go on, tell me what it said. What's that? Sir Hendrick is the mightiest swordsman, but Sir Jasper is a peerless military mid tactician. I've heard as much. And between the two of them, they made Heliodor a nigh unbeatable military force. Well, I never fancy that. Oh, I'm so glad you shared that with me. Now I feel a lot closer to my heroes, and I feel a lot safer knowing that they're around to protect Heliodor. Thank you so much for enlightening me. I may not have met them, but this is the next best thing. Here's a little something to say thank you. A Drusillian shilling. Okay, 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 okay. I don't need to talk to you. At first, when the, the camera went up to the ceiling, I was like, oh my gosh, is something going to fall on me and I'm gonna die? Give me your stuff! Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, oh, I don't have enough money! Copper chopper! Oh, can I sell some stuff? I can't sell Gemma's Charm! Seed of skill? Whoa! A nifty nut that confers an extra skill point upon anyone who eats it consumed upon use. Yo! I can eat that. A soporific flower that can send a single enemy to sleep consumed upon use. Well, if I... Fishnet stockings? But someone can wear it, so I don't want to sell it. Okay, so I'm going to eat some... I'm gonna eat some seeds. I gained one skill point. Might as well just use it all on me, because I'm the main character! Okay. Cotton top. Okay, now I go to Misk and Character Builder and me! Let's see, how much was this? This is eight. Okay, so I don't can't even do that. So I'll just go to swords. Critical chance when wielding 2%. But that is 6p. I only have 5p. Attack power when wielding. Yeah, sure. And then it'll get me one step closer to um one step closer to this thing. Yeah. So I have to get that that. I would rather get stronger weapons more than armor, so... Let me go back to church to save since I did quests. And then I'll go outside and see just how strong the enemies are. When you go to sleep in an inn or... Camp can stay overnight or pick the time of day for certain monster spawns at times. Oh, okay. Then I'll, whoops, I'll pray, I'll sleep, I'll talk to the king. I really want to eat more pumpkin cheesecake. Should I do it? Should I do it? Should I eat the last of the cheesecake? Okay, in, in, in. Hopefully, staying at the inn doesn't cost money, but it probably will. Wait, can I go down? Can I go down here? Nope. Oh, I can! Hi. So much to do, so little time! Are there any barrels to break? Nope. Broke a bucket, though. Something so much fun! Whee! Welcome to Rainbows and Bank! Huh? Um, I don't have enough money, so cancel. 
Okay, so this lady's probably the inn. Yeah. No gift to me. <laughs> um, stay overnight. Oh, three gold coins. Nice. But I want the cheesecake, but I only have three slices. Let's just do it. Let's just finish the cheesecake. King, here I come! Wait, there's no quest on the left side, right? Yeah, no quests. There are houses to the left, but I don't feel like going in there right now. Oh, wait. But I should go into rich people's houses. Because they have stuff that I can steal. So I can't actually go into any of their rooms, but I can only just do this. Lean, your house sucks! Unless... Yeah, barrels. Haha! -ha, 25! And that house is just totally not able to go into, okay? Jump in the... Yeah! I'm a mischief maker. Man, Royal Plaza is beautiful, but it only has four houses. Not so fancy schmancy! Halt! Not so fast. Your face. State your business. Finally made it to the stream full time. I don't care how much time is left. Haha. <laughs> Jelly Toast explains that he's a luminary and he's come to speak to the king. <laughs> <laughs> Here, shake my hand, mate. That's the funniest one I've heard all week. Clear off, will ya? We haven't got time for this kind of nonsense. Oh, yeah. Ah. Ooh. What's that? You want to show that pendant to the king, you say? Luminary? Egad! Ah. Do you mind waiting here a minute? Throw him in jail! Ever so sorry for that little misunderstanding. Please, go right on through. His Majesty's waiting for you. Something's gonna happen. A misunderstanding's gonna happen, and I'm gonna get thrown in jail. I just know it. The time of day and type of weather can influence a lot of things in Erdrea, so that's when monsters appear. Cool. Pretty. Hi. His Majesty is waiting for you. To get in the throne room, head up these stairs and go straight on. Thank you. But what if I detour and go into all these shiny rooms? I'm about 70 hours into this one. Hope you enjoy it. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for joining. Long time to see. I am only two hours into it. Ha 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 ha. Book called King Carnelian Behind the Door of Jelly Toast. Having several generations of his life, I can say with some certainty that King Carnelian is a rare breed of Mara, possessed of all qualities, required, and a truly great leader, both loved and feared by the populace. He is like a father to them. Kind of stern for me, a fair, not since the days of the King of Old has a great mission being so blessed, though his face may have grown hard and lined in the terrible events that took place a few short years ago. Some might say that this has added a certain depth that improves it yet further. To have resolutely overcome such grief and yet still led his nation on boldly onward, a sure sign that Carnelian is king among kings. Ooh, wow, I didn't have to spend money on Wayfarer's clothes because I just picked some up now. Great. It's a disgrace. Unbelievable. My eyes, too pretty. I never found the DQ8 outfit. Where was it? Um, I got the Definitive S edition for PS4, and I think it just came with it. 
I can't read that fast. <laughs> There's a book called Ur Urdrian Geographic. <laughs> of the many nations, both large and small, that make up Urdrian, there are five the so called great five that stand above all others in the eyes of the world. Ancient and honorable Jundrasil, Sephast, Stony Heliodor, Galapagos with its noble desert, Sniffleheim, Sniffleheim, <laughs> with its snow capped towers, and last but not least, Wardos, were covered in, in flowers. These five great nations describe the world, meeting after a few years in the great conference known as the Colloquy of Kings. Colloquy of Kings, whatever. In order to steer the course of Urdrian affairs in the direction to agreeable to all. It's Trunks' sword, is it? A chest. Hello. Hands off, Archon. Those are the gifts for the king. You so much trust me, you'll be sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't know. Time to run to the other side. Let's look at the far room first. Okay, nothing to break there. I love Akia. Toriyama material, close enough. <laughs> yeah, every time I see characters, I'm just like, Dragon Ball! Or Chrono Trigger. Ooh, I got a leather hat. Leather hat. Maximum MP down and charm down, but, oh, uh, yeah. No, I want to be charming. I'm a charming boy. Whoops! I've only heard my mom read, like, that fast. I'm saying all the words incorrectly, though. I'm mumbling them and jumbling them. I see too much Gohan in Android 18. Heck yeah. Chop his head! Training with Sir Hedrick is Zoxin. I'm just taking a little breather. You're weak. Wow, nothing? Poor. I did antidotal herb, medicinal herb. Oh, the herbs! Okay, now I shall see this king. F you, I hope your family has a nice Christmas. <laughs> Happy birthday to the ground! This is Majesty's chamber. Before you ask, no, you're not coming in. This entrance is the late princess's chamber. I'm afraid I cannot permit you to pass. <gasps> the princess being my mama. Gosh, how big is this place? Oh my word. What? Trying to get into Princess's room, I see how vulgar. I didn't know it was the Princess's room. Dose of strong medicine. But what the heck is this thing? It disappeared. Okay. Follow the noodle arm potato baby. <laughs> but I can't do anything with it. Let's see, was there anything on the other side or did it just loop around? Okay, here you are. You're very cute. Where are you going? Okay, you just disappear into the corner. Alright. Ooh, balcony. I really need to stop turning the camera around so much because I think I'm starting to get dizzy. Ooh. Pots. Speed of Therapeusis. There's shiny up there. How do I get it? Probably need another character or something. Okay, let's go out onto the balcony. That thing always gives me the creeps. I think it's cute. Head out to the balcony, yes. Mm, can I break you? Yes, I can. Just by walking into you, apparently. But I can't break pots that way. Yeah, pots I have to pick up. A single file of what? Hi. I can't stop thinking about that star. 
cool. The textures, mmm. Get back inside, yes. Okay, okay, really, let's go meet the king now. I'm running on empty. Uh, I'm slowly fading. I'm turning the camera way too much. Give me, give me two more sessions and then I'll be completely used to it. Potato baby! Wait, I didn't examine the other side, did I? Yeah, cause this side was noodle arm potato baby. Yeah, pots. Did you explore the town at night? No. Is it different at night? I just went to sleep so I could, um... <gasps> I'm wasting too much time! Oh no! I need to go talk to the king! Ah, but are there pots on this side? No. It's peaceful? It does, it does seem peaceful, but I wanted to move on with the story, so I just went to sleep at the inn. Okay, let's meet the king. Oh, Sama! Hydrate, oh yes, hydrating, important. Oh. That will be quite close enough. Welcome to Heliodor Castle. Well, thank friend. you. What's up? I am the luminary. The jewel of Dundrasil. You are bold indeed to have made your way here alone, wanderer. No, it was just a street. I shot. am Carnelian, ruler of Heliodor. Ruler. How long have I waited for this day? And now, finally, we meet. Truly, it is an honor. The fact that you come here proffering the jewel and asking to speak with it's me Dr. personally Giro, ruler would of the suggest Red that Army. you know something of your true nature. I take it that you also bear the mark? The mark of light. Does he not look like then him? There he is totally no looks doubt. like him. You are he. Rejoice, dear subjects. The day I is look upon like us Tom's at last. Yeah, do. The luminary walks among us. I'd once rather be more. Gohan. <laughs> Gohan's my favorite Dragon Ball Z character. <laughs> Tell me, <laughs> oh luminary. Where exactly is it that you hail from? I would so very much like to pay tribute to those who took you in and raised you. Deli Toast tells Carnelian he was raised in the village of Cobblestone. And now Cobblestone shall be destroyed. Cobblestone, Jasper, you know of this place? I do, my liege. A village of provincial nobodies deep in the rocky south. Wow, nobody. Then I take it you know what to do. Do not disappoint Yo, me. Yo, King, you're messed up. Yes, my liege. They're going to destroy Cobblestone. Cursed luminary. I know not what your intent was in coming here alone, but whatever your wicked scheme, know that it shall not succeed. Huh? Ah. <laughs> Hendrik, take this cur, this harbinger yep. of calamity. This is why I get thrown into the dungeon. Cast him into the furthest corner of the dungeon. Oh, probably because he thinks like know this. I caused. The luminary the death of the is the root of all evil and will bring naught but misery to our realm. And why is this? The reason is simple. 
Just as light is intertwined with darkness, <laughs> so too <laughs> is the luminary Thanks, intertwined with the dread lord of shadows. His coming heralds the resurrection of the Dark One. Did you really think you could fool one as wise as his majesty? It was your great misfortune to confront one who knows your true nature. Aren't you my grandpa? Man, seize this wretch! Man, you messed up. To your own grandson. Fierce the hobbitches. They want to steal it from us. Precious. Not really. He's not my grandpa? I thought I was a princess's son. Oh, I'm not? <laughs> That's lame. I'm adopted. Yeah, I know I'm adopted. Can't say, yeah, don't say. I don't want to be spoiled. You claim to hail from Cobblestone. Well, before the sun has set three times, we shall know the truth. By then, Jasper will have returned from his investigation. Your goatee is ugly. If I were you, Dark Spawn, I would not expect to live beyond that day. Hmm. Hello, future party member. I am here. A hero in chains, awarded for fulfilling your duty and traveling to Hellior Castle, only to be damned as Darkspawn and thrown into the dungeons by King Carnelian. Hey, cut it out. Get a grip. Making a racket isn't going to help you any. I just wanted to save those items, man. Uh, can I save? Darkspawn, what is this? Dragon Age? Here in chains? Called evil? Sounds like Yuri Lowell to me. <laughs> Sheesh, keep it down, will you? There goes the neighborhood. Will you keep it down in there? Most folks they throw in here have the decency to wait a while before going stir crazy. What are you in for, anyhow? You don't get free bed and board down here without having done something pretty bad. I'm the Luminary. Wait, did you say the Luminary? You're it serious. just auto-saved on you? Cool. Because I'm getting dizzy. You're telling me the Luminary has just shown up in the cell next to mine. This is crazy. One plate of delicious gruel for a gentleman in the dungeon suite. Come and get it. <laughs> How did you know he'd have a key? The Luminary. You're serious? So serious. So it's all happening just like the seer said it would. We'd better get out of here. Yeah, let's go. Wait here. You, but oh! 
Don't worry, I didn't kill him. But he won't be waking up anytime soon. Things should get pretty hairy up ahead. You'd better take this. Uh, please, just s stop. I need to save. <laughs> oh, and I found this in a corner over there. I guess it's your stuff, right? I got my lost belongings! Me? I got this little beauty back. So now I'm pretty much unstoppable. We'd better get out of here before any more of our tin-headed friends come knocking. Hollow, when you're ready to move out, okay? Smart. Take a torch. Uh... Are you... <laughs> Heal all character... Builder tactics, travelers tips info. Um, can I save anywhere here? Doors locked tight, but I thought I had the key. Why not? Do you want to get caught or something? There's too many guards that way. Stick with me. Some Assassin's Creed shiz. Heck yeah. Okay, I guess I'll do this last thing and then I'll see if it auto saves if I go to the next area. And then I gotta really end because I'm getting so. I spent dizzy. ages digging this hole and you just happen to show up the day I finish it? Heck of a coincidence. Shawshank! Guess I really was meant to help you out, just like the seer said. Anyway, there'll be time to talk about all that later. In you go. Should save after this scene. Cool, awesome. I really need to lie down. I got too crazy with the camera spinning. The sewers, huh? Well, there must be a way out somewhere. Lead the way. I got your back. I don't know what this place looks like. <laughs> but I'll do it. Because I'm the hero. Auto-saving, thank the lord! Okay, well, that's going to be it for me tonight. I'm getting really dizzy. Ooh, okay, I really need to lie down sleep. But Dragon Quest, so beautiful, so fun. I'll be playing this until I beat it. Um, and then, yeah, hopefully I'll beat it before April because that's when Near Replicant comes out. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna be it for me. Spinning can help with Disney. <laughs> no, it can't. Um, today's Wednesday, right? Today's Wednesday. Okay, yeah, so no more streams for the rest of this week. Oh. But yay, we're starting it. We're finally doing it. It's beautiful. I'm gonna play more next week. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Stay toasty. Have a good night. Have a good weekend. Stay healthy and safe. See you next time. Bye-bye.